Happy Easter, everyone, and welcome to Marco Island. I thought we'd take a quick look at what it's like on Marco in season on Easter Sunday. This is really kind of the last hurrah. Now, the beach looks busy, but it was far busier yesterday. I'm guessing a lot of people were already starting to head home. It's the last day of the holiday weekend, but we'll go down there and take a look. It looks like the further you get down South Beach, the busier it gets. Not a bad day in the beach. What a beautiful day. I'm gonna start by heading north. A little more activity up that direction too. Boy, it's nice and quiet right here. A lot of shells wash up on Marco. So if you wanna go shelling, this is actually a pretty good island for it. If you count the waves, about every seventh wave comes up a little higher. Just enough to get your feet wet. You can see there's a lot of boats out today. I don't see any parasailing. Now most of these buildings are private condos, but there are a few hotels on here. Probably the biggest, most prestigious is the JW Marriott. Um, it's smack dab in the middle coming up here, but really a lot of nice places here, Marco. Some folks are fishing here. Want to make sure you don't get in the way of the fishing lines. We're coming up on one of the resorts. You're going to see all of these umbrellas are the same color, and that's why. There are some people out there on paddle boards. Way out on the horizon, it looks like there's a parasailer. Very crowded down here. And you can see the jet ski rentals lined up down here as well. Now you can see a few of those parasailers are up way in the distance. When the tide comes in and the waves, you can see there's this little area here not quite what I would call a tide pool but a lot of shells probably find some nice ones I want to spend a little time they never fully recovered here after the hurricane so you can see it's pretty empty There might be a few people that came and launched their boats today. Not too many, however. I'm not seeing any of the burrowing owls today either. Not full. And you can see the lots are full and people are waiting to get in. There's a JW Marriott. And when these lights are flashing, you gotta stop. It means someone is crossing the road. There are some people all packed up heading to the beach. This is called Residence Beach. It's where people who live on Marco can come and park their cars. You won't get in there without a resident pass. Let's see if Doreen's is still busy. It's way past breakfast time. 
that it's cleared out. Thanks for joining me on this Easter Sunday at Marco Island. I hope you enjoyed our little visit. As always, I encourage you to like and share the videos. Leave your comments down below. If you haven't already, please subscribe by clicking my face in the corner. And don't forget to ring that bell icon. That way you'll know when I post new videos. From Marco Island, I'm Mark, and this is the Average Me Channel.